Hi guys, welcome back to our channel and in today's video we are going to help you determine the Lewis structure for HNO3 molecule. It's a chemical formula for nitric acid and to determine its lowest structure we are first going to look at the total number of valence electrons for this molecule. So here we have one hydrogen atom that has one valence electron. We have five valence electrons from nitrogen atom and we have three into six that is 18 valence electrons from oxygen atom. So in total we have 24 valence electrons for HNO3. Once you know that you can start placing the atoms and show the bond formation between these atoms. So here nitrogen atom will take the central position. We are going to place three oxygen atoms like this and the H the hydrogen atom would be placed near oxygen atom like this. Now we will start placing a, a pairs of electrons to show a bond. So I am going to place a pair of electron between O and H. I am going to place the other electron pairs between nitrogen and oxygen atoms. Now uh, the remaining electrons will be placed around oxygen atom so that they can have complete octet. So I am going to place 6 valence ele electrons around each oxygen atom and make sure that there are complete octets for all oxygen atoms. Once you have done that you can see that your hydrogen atom has 2 valence electrons which means it has a complete outer shell. Oxygen atoms over here have 8 valence electrons which means it has a complete octet. But when we come to nitrogen we only have 6 valence electrons in its outer shell and to try and uh, make this octet complete we are going to shift a pair of electron from this oxygen atom over here in between this nitrogen and oxygen atom. This way both oxygen and nitrogen atoms will have complete octets and um, if we calculate the formal charges of, uh, of the atoms in HNO3 nitrogen will have a charge of plus 1 and the oxygen atom will have a charge of minus 1. So uh, this is a correct way to write the Lewis structure for HNO3. However, you might have questions if why can't we take the pair of electrons from this oxygen atom. So the answer it is already forming bonds with hydrogen atoms and if you shift a pair from this oxygen atom, the formal charges will be very um, high, like the formal charges will not be close to zero for this uh, arrangement. Uh, for this arrangement over here, we have minus 1 on oxygen, plus 1 on nitrogen and 0 on all the remaining atoms. But when you opt for any other arrangement, for the arrangement in which you are shifting a pair of electrons from the oxygen that is forming a bond with hydrogen atom, it is going to um, disturb the formal charges and that will not be relevant to structure. So the arrangement should be such that the atoms in this molecule have charges close to zero and this structure or even this structure is a relevant lowest structure so basically we do not shift the electrons from the oxygen atom that is forming a bond with hydrogen atom you can shift a shift a pair of electron from this oxygen atom or from this oxygen atom to form a lowest structure for hno3 so this is the lowest structure for hno3 both these diagrams are accepted for drawing the lowest structure for nitric acid and i hope this video helps you to understand that for more such videos on Lewis structure molecular geometry, polarity of the molecules, make sure to subscribe to our channel and thank you for watching.